Yo, what is going on guys? Bobby here and today we are back with another video as you guys can see on the screen I'm currently in a friendly room with six very top tier pros in North America. We have myself Toast, Alec, Fade, Charles and Sword. What we're gonna be doing is showing you guys the new feature in friendly rooms Which is going to be the draft aka power match So we're expecting next year in competitive that power match is going to be the competitive format so what that basically is is you have a draft there's a timer it's exactly like power league you ban brawlers you pick brawlers whatever and you go into a best of three a best of five or a best of seven now we're going to be keeping it as a best of three today we're going to be doing a best of three best of three with random teams and just showing you guys the draft showing you guys the best plays etc if you guys like this and you guys want to see more you know kind of competitive gameplay where we get the best players in north america all in a room but we can do some funny challenges some different type of stuff to make it more interesting let me know in the comment section below we're going to be randomizing the teams right now using random dot org so i'm going to be putting the numbers of the players on the screen and let's get into it and let's see what the teams are okay so i'm doing it on my phone it's going to be full screened on your screen right now but we're generating the numbers one to six so we're getting number three number six and number five so that's going to be the team three six five of toast alec and fade versus me sword and charles so let's make that the teams let's get into the draft and let's start this all right so map number one that we're going to be doing is hot potato so let's see what is going on right here blue team starts which is going to be us rico's probably the best brawler on the map um so i'm going to go ahead and not ban rico because they're probably going to do it i can definitely see them taking rico i mean banning rico sorry yep there we go they ban rico sword's going to first pick daryl I know Sword way too well. I knew he was going to first pick that. Okay, so it's our pick now. Toast went M's. Fade took Ash. And then Charles took Barley. So we need something that's pretty good into tanks and mid range. We have a thrower already. So we don't really need DPS. We need more or less some damage. So what I think I'm going to do is go ahead and take Tara. Now, Tara, you guys might think, is a weird pick. But I actually really like Tara as of late. It's just kind of good at everything. And with the new speed gear that's in the game, that's obviously incredibly broken it's good against basically every single brawler except for you know it's hard counters m's being one of them but i think it's going to be okay so let's hop into the game after we see what alec takes which is going to be bull and you know what let's see how we do okay so let's see how this goes we're going to be entering the mid grass right here so we're just going to be running to the right side i think alec's game might have crashed which is a bug that's been happening as of late which is something we're going to have to fight through so we're going to go in. he's going to get 10 percent i'm just going to chip super off of Alec. Fade's trapped in a corner right here, so we're gonna try and kill Fade. He's one shot. We're gonna be able to get that kill. Alec's gonna be on the safe. He's no longer a bot. We're gonna solo pull. Alright, we're gonna be able to get the kill over there. Okay, moving up kind of aggro. We're only down 1%. Can okay, we have the lead now? Alec's probably going to rush the safe. I'm not sure. I'm gonna put my pets down. Uh, the pets are gonna go down, but we did a lot of damage right there. Oh, we did a ton of damage, actually. Alec's gonna go up, try and do a ton. Oh, they have their gears and everything. They're gonna do a lot of damage as well. I'm gonna try and defend this here. Fade's gonna move up. I'm just gonna try and pull one and get control. Sword's gonna go up, so I'm just gonna move over here. I'm gonna pull Fade into the safe maybe oh that didn't work out so i guess i just pulled the safe but my little tar pet's doing some work oh my god it's doing a lot of work actually and that is going to be game number one right there so i think we definitely did have an outdraft let's cop or not let's cop let's hop into game number two and okay so we're kind of getting snuck on right here in the middle don't know where the out oh, there's the ash okay ash is gonna whip a shot over there we're gonna move up oh ash does a lot of damage actually we're gonna try and help charles out charles is gonna be able to get that kill we're gonna move forward. We're gonna solo pull Toast over there, and now we're gonna get a ton of damage onto the safe. We're gonna try and protect as much as we can. We're gonna solo pull Fade over here. Again, this is why I love Tara. It's just so good for positioning. We already have the DPS, so there's really no reason for me to go something that does damage. Something that does control is way, or not does control, but something that maintains control is just way better. And this is also just really good defense against tanks. So hopefully we don't get snuck on. Uh, Fade's gonna be coming through the middle. We're just gonna try and get a solo pull on anyone. That's our goal here. Sword's gonna mess up his role pretty badly. Uh, and we're gonna look for either Toast or Alec here. Alec's gonna go down, Toast is gonna go down. And this is probably looking like map number one for us. And okay, there we go. So it looks like we're gonna finish the safe over there. It was kinda easy. I think we definitely outdrafted 
by a lot. So that's going to be set number one. Again, it's a best of three, best of three. So we're now up one nothing in sets. If we win the next map, we take it home. So let's hop into the next map and let's see if we can take the W. Okay, so the next map we're going to be doing is Ring of Fire. So I'm going to show you guys the bands. Then we're going to skip on over to my pick and I'll summarize everything. Again, we have pick number one. Um, I don't know what the best brawler on this map really is these days. I think what I'm going to do though is ban... I really don't know. I think I'm just going to... I'm going to ban Lola and hope we get Meg. I think that's going to be the goal here. So they ban Spike, which works out perfectly. I'm going to flash Meg right now for Sword. I'm pretty sure he's going to take it. Sword's a pretty good drafter. Uh, and we're going to see what they get. I don't really think they can go anything that hard counters Meg too much outside of Tara. So... Let's hop into the end of the draft, which is going to be my pick, and let's show you guys what happened. Okay, so hopping into game number two, or I should say match number two, we take Meg. They go Byron and Crow, which is a pretty good combination. I guess they want to take away some sort of healing aspect. Um, I expected them to go with Tara as it's the biggest hard counter for Meg. So I'm going to take Tara because obviously I don't want them to get it. I think they would just counter Meg way too much. And they're going to first pick Amber. I think, it, or not first pick, sorry, last pick Amber. I think it was pretty obvious that I was going to go Tara because if they took it, it obviously would have been incredibly difficult uh, for us to do anything. So we'll see how this goes. I get kind of hard countered on the lanes a little bit, but I think our core, our maiden, just our cob synergy is, is really strong. Okay, so going into the game, I'm going to be going up the right side here into the crow. I'm going to put this down, try and gain some positioning here. Kind of difficult to do so, but we're going to be doing our best. I'm just trying to charge my super at this point. We got pretty... Oh, come on, sword. Not really, you know, too much ground to my super, but Charles got his, so that's obviously really good. Bade still has three slows left on his crow. He uses the first one over there on me and the Meg. I'm just trying to peek right here. And I'm just going to use my pets until I get my super. And then once I get my super, it's going to be a lot easier to kind of just rotate my supers, you know, cycle them. One player is going to go down. We're going to try and get Fade over here. He's one shot. Charles is going to be able to do so. He's also going to get his mech. So now we're in a really good spot. This is exactly where we want to be. I'm going to sneak into these bushes here. Fade's going to jump on Sword. Sword's going to get the kill. And this is what we want. This exact positioning right here. Gonna move somewhat towards the middle. Gonna just solo full fade. We're gonna get that kill. And I'm gonna go down. Sword still currently has the mid though. Okay, so they currently have control. I'm in the bushes. I'm gonna go for a solo pull on fade. I'm gonna be able to do so. And now we're gonna try and get that position we had earlier back where we had me and Charles in the grass over here. That's definitely the best we can do. But again, my job here is just to try and stand here, be a distraction, and just solo pull players. So I have my pull right now. Alec kind of knows he's getting pulled, so he's going to stay back from us. Oh, that's a win. You guys didn't see that right there. Okay, so Charles is going to get our mech. We should have won this game, but I kind of whiffed my super. If, you know, maybe Fudge can edit it out and be the go editor. No. No, I don't think I will. But I'm not expecting that. Um, so Alec is just going to kind of juke in the middle. He's not going to be able to do anything. If Charles gets his mech, I'm pretty sure we're going to win. Oh, yeah. He gets his mech over there. We're going to get double slowed. But we have control right now. I'm pretty close to my super. I think we just should heal up here. Because Charles is going to go down. We're going to heal. We're going to get our super. Pull them both. And that is going to be match number one. So going into game number two. Again, the comps are kind of even. I think any team can win. But I think we played it a little bit better outside of that missed pull. So let's hop into it and let's see what happens. Okay, so I just went down after trying to charge my super and using all three of my pets. Again, they have the same lead as last time, 40 to nothing. So it's going to be incredibly difficult to win this game um, unless Sword gets to tap in because that would really be our you know, easiest way of winning is just a mid diff, but I really don't think that's going to happen. Um, we're going to go down and now they're, they have a pretty thick lead and we have absolutely no chance in this game, I think. 75 nothing for them right now 80 percent i'm just getting my first super now we're gonna be able to get it but it might be too little too late we're gonna get slowed here they have a lot of percentage i'm just gonna use my super I'm gonna pull alec we're gonna be able to get that kill and who knows maybe we can hold for 100 percent i'm gonna say probably not but i suppose it's possible oh we kill fade over there charles needs to get his back he's gonna get it Oh, my auto-aim shoots backwards for whatever reason, and that's going to be a really, 
really good win for them. So this is actually going to be pretty difficult. I think they figured out how to play the comp. Uh, so let's hop into game number three and let's see what we can do into this comp. Okay, so I'm expecting Alec to be right here. He is going to be here. I got some good shots, definitely way closer to my super at the start of the game. This game than I was last. Sword's also going to kill Toast. That's a really strong start for us. Alex going to miss his super over there. And again, I'm just trying to get my super at this point. Not really trying to do anything else. Oh, we're going to be able to kill Fade. So that's actually really good for us. Alec, he kind of looks like he's out of ammo. Oh, he's not. I was really hoping he was. Oh, either way, we're going to be able to get the kill. We almost run away. We're not going to be able to. But I do have my super much, much earlier than I did last game. So that's obviously really good. Okay, so we're going to try and get some positioning here. We have the grass with Charles. This is exactly what we wanted. Um, and this is what we, you know, kind of hope for with our comp. We're going to go for the pull here. Oh, we're going to get all three players. And that is going to get us a lot of percentage. So we can kind of just chill in this grass right now. I'm going to go right in the middle. I'm going to go for the double pull. Looks like Fade either bought it out or gave up. It's going to be one or the other, but either way, I'm pretty sure that this is going to be a win for us. We can go for another double pull. All right, it's only going to be one. Never mind. But either way, we have a pretty thick lead. That's probably going to be it for this match. 90% to 40. I mean, it's just looking pretty good. I even got some Tara pets left over. But it looks like that is going to be game and that is going to be match. So that's going to be it for this video. We're going to take the set and the match to nothing in the best of three, best of three. If you guys want to see something like this more often, obviously there's tons of more pro players if you guys want to see them that I can get in the video. And there's also tons and tons and tons of stipulations, challenges, prizes, etc. that we can do. So if you guys like this type of format for a video, let me know in the description, or not in the description, in the comment section below. But that's going to be it for me today. If you guys enjoyed, subscribe, thumbs up, all that. And I will be back again tomorrow. Peace. Hey you. Yes you there watching this on your phone. Have you ever wanted to be the best? The most handsome? The most loved player on your team? And support your favorite creator at the same time? Well I have good news. You can be all of that and more, by using code Bobby. But you have to do it now because this is a limited time offer. Use code Bobby at any Supercell Games store.